So on the last picture I put up, a lot of people have been asking me about the different side trays that I use on this coring chair. So I thought I would set it up for a day's fishing and just show you exactly what I use. So I'll start with the side trays. So on the left hand side, I've got a slim line pressed in Ventolite. Now that's fantastic because it reaches both front and the back leg without any problems. It's super sturdy and I use that for tackle boxes and stuff like that. Keep my flasks on it and stuff. And then on this side, I've got the new fish hooded side tray. Now obviously because of the width of this side tray, it does not fit on its own. So what I have here is the Preston Universal Arm, which attaches onto this leg here. Um, and then attaches here. So you need the 30mm insert for this side, the 25mm insert for this side. And then you have a decent, sturdy, proper two-legged side tree on this side. For the butt rest, I just have the Preston, the Preston butt rest. And then for the feeder arm, this is the Opbox feeder arm. Um, this is, other than the feeder land, it's probably the best feeder arm out there, and it's a fraction of the price. It's only about 30 quid. Um, it's telescopic. You can either have it attached upright, or there's a threaded end in the bottom. Um, <coughs> screw here for the telescope. And then here you have two arms, one on this side allows you to spin it and then on this side just get my leg in the way there we go allows you so you can have it at any angle vertically and horizontally um, and it telescopes out and once it's all together it really is it's the sturdiest it's as sturdy as the feed line without a shadow of a doubt so that's my setup for the feed chair.